Come check it out, guys. This is a four millimeter lens, so it's pretty zoomed in. Oh, I'm losing it. Isn't that pretty? The Sea of Tranquility, where Apollo 11 landed, is Right here, in that dark gray area. Right there. And one of those specks in that dark gray area right there is the lunar base, the flag the rover and uh, a couple plaques a little human statue and a bunch of other stuff tonight I'm out here with the um, Celestron Nexstar 8 SE computerized looking through this little four millimeter hole Check it out. Let me turn off the light. One second. And there she is. Anyways, yeah, guys. That moon up there. Hard to see with a normal camera or cell phone, but with my uh, my telescope here, you can see plenty of things. This amazing telescope was donated by Eric. Bookman and this is the star finder or finder scope if you look through here at the red dot and line up whatever you're looking at because it's very hard to find things it's a red dot scope basically it's very hard to find things with this tiny little lens here because with this four millimeter, it's basically a tiny little um, tip of a pen or pencil point in the sky. So one small movement of the controller and basically in the lens, 
everything whips across the screen really fast. So it's really hard to find something with the lens. So you use a finder scope. And when it's aligned with the telescope itself, all you do is look through the red dot just like a gun. And when the red dot's lined up, you're good to go. So, yeah. Hope you guys enjoy. Come out to H.M. Shaw's Veterans Ranch for more. And to uh, learn about the wonderful, beautiful universe that we live in. And also help take care of some uh, some veterans in need and first responders in need. So, Anyways, guys, hope to see you soon. We have another uh, star party coming up this month. It's free. I uh, hope to see you all there. All right. Good night, guys.